Now, depending on the way the substances conduct electricity, we can again divide it into two, two types, right? So, based on the way in which electricity is conducted, we have two types of materials. The first is called the metallic or, or the electronic conduction. Electronic conduction. Okay. As we know, in metals, we have got a lot of free electrons and it is the free electrons which move in the face of the field being set up inside the wire, right? So, so, electricity conduction is done by electrons it is done by electrons okay it depends on the type of metal it depends on the type of metal okay In the sense that, or, or I can say, on the nature and structure of metal. <clears throat> it also depends on the number of valence electron. Depends on the number of valence electron okay <clears throat> and we have studied that in detail in physics electricity physics that the its resistance increases with 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 the resistance increases with with increase in temperature if the resistance increases if the resistance increases that means the conductance decreases so the conductance decreases with increase in temperature increase in temperature Okay, and one more important thing is that the metal does not change its characteristic, change its characteristic, its characteristic with the passage of current, with the passage of The metal does not change its nature. Howsoever long you keep on passing current through, say, say a copper wire, copper wire remains a copper wire. It does not undergo any chemical change whatsoever. Okay? 